And today's sentencing of Derek Chauvin shows how video from body cameras can play a key role in trials. Yeah, the Kern County Sheriff's Office is adding new upgrades to their fleet, including more public access to videos. Eyewitness News reporter Savannah Welch has a preview. Savannah? Well, the Kern County Sheriff's Office is getting a big upgrade in a small package with their new body cameras. I had the chance myself to try them out just to see how they work. They may be small, but these cameras are a big upgrade for the Kern County Sheriff's Office. The office has been working on a $5 million project with the county to outfit every officer with an upgraded body cam. In addition to better video and audio, these cameras have GPS tracking and use signal technology. Once a firearm is drawn, the cameras turn on, saving the previous 30 seconds of video and everything after that. The Kern County Sheriff's Office says they hope to have 313 of these body cams in use by September 1st. They also say these cameras can help de-escalate situations in the field and keep a record of what happens. We want to protect their identity, their, their rights uh, long and balancing that with the public's need to know the information and share the videos that we need to share. The videos from the cameras are stored on a wireless database for a minimum of 13 months. They have a secure process for video release on their website. We're about transparency. This will give another level of that transparency, make sure that the officers are doing what they're supposed to be doing. Just like their firearms, when the officers draw their tasers, that will also activate the cameras. Once the taser is removed from its holster, it activates the camera to start rolling. <laughs> Officers can also manually record without activating a weapon. Sydney Sigmuth with Axon Technology, who made the cameras, says the purpose of the technology is to keep people safe. People are very interested in the, getting that additional situational awareness, um, being able to just have extra eyes on a situation again. Officers can also record without actually activating their weapons. To send a request for body cam footage, you can go through the Sheriff's Office or access the form page on our website at bakersfieldnow.com. Is there a story you think we should investigate? Call our Eyewitness News tip line at 869-2929.